Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nusli and today I have this fluffable product I want to try out. So I usually don't play with these kind of things, um, but there was one day I was at the art store and they have this um, for $10.99 and I was like, what is this? It looks so fluffy. If I can't get a cat, what if I make myself a cat or a dog? So it caught my attention and today I want to open it up and to just to see how it works for you all and maybe do a little bit testing and on the side it says the one I chose called pumpkin yeah and it has mystery mystery accessory inside and in the back it has like a little bit thing I'll tell you how to like how this work but I had to say like this is kind of scary the one I out thing but Let's let's just start. Let's start it right now to see. Um. Okay. So you got a slit. Um. It seems super easy on a slit. It just tells you how it works. But I bet this is gonna take a while. And on the on the back it says you need to trim it. It has the trim part, so it's gonna be kind of difficult. But we shall see. And. We're gonna take all the product out. This is, I think this is the body. This is what the body looks like. It's not fluffy, it's kind of harsh. And this is all, this is all like small things in there. Um, let me see what these are. Oh, it has stuff for the eyes, the styling. Oh, it's, um, and everything. Open it up. This is the mysterious um, accessory. And what is this? Ooh, it's, it's, it's a pair of glasses. That's really cute. And what else do we have? This is. Uh, I think this is the eye. Um, this is the ear and the tail. Yeah. Alright. And. Let me see what this. Oh, this is the kneading part that you need to poke into the body, and you got one little nose, which is super duper cute, like that. And you got two eyes, like that. Okay, that's good. What else do we have? So we got a bunch of yarn, and that's it, and this is nothing. Okay, all empty, and we're gonna set all these aside, and get started. On the instruction, it says pick a pattern or make your own. So it is an option for you to make your own, but I don't know what I want mine to look like. It's okay. It's, it's fine. Um, the first thing it says you need to do is to get an ear. This is the ear. And you need the kneading tool. Which look like that. Okay. I'm gonna start. I think this is it. Just push that in. That's what it says on here. Okay, that's one year. And uh, it has another one. In here. Is that even? Okay. It looked like that. Cute. And for the bottom, you need to push it in like that. I find it's actually kind of hard for me to do it because, like, you want you, like, you need to know what kind you want it to be. So I feel like it's somewhat a little bit hard. 
And on here, you want me to twist in the eyes and the nose. And you want you to stop on here at the like the little screw in. Okay, so I'm gonna do that. Oh shoot! This is the nose. Damn. Okay, let me let me let me let me get the eye. Twist. And twist. 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 <gasps> okay, it should be looking like that. That's on the instruction. And I'm gonna do the other eye. Twist. Why is not twisting? Oh wow, this is so far really cute. Um, and I'm gonna twist in the nose. All right, done. And now you want me to open this? It says grab your f and back. My um camera suddenly died, so I'm gonna pick up with wherever I was, and I'm gonna just fluff off the part. When it's not smooth. Can you tell the difference? There's some part of it is smooth, like the bottom, but top it's not smooth. And it says just to smooth that part, uh, fluff that part. So I'm gonna do that. like this so far this is so far right, I'm back after like literally 30 minutes I have managed to make it into this fur ball <laughs> um, you can't barely see the eyes and everything but um, I'm gonna keep going an instruction it says if you finish all of this gently comb it through I think it's because it want me um it wanted to like get rid of the the fur and everything. I have to say, although I like this, but this whole process of making it, it really is buggering me for the hair and everything because um, the hair, it is just killing me. I do not like um, the process of making the hair. Um, it's flying everywhere and it got on my clothes, it got on, um, it got into my face and my whole shirt is covered with hair. Okay, and it says want me to trim it. I think the difficult part is to trim it, to be honest, because you, you, it's kind of hard to make it look even. All right, I have finished my fluffable, and this is what it looks like right now. I know it's not like the best looking ever, but I have to say, um, I really enjoyed the look of it and it's really fluffy, I do like it. Um, it still has a little bit hair file out, uh, just because the whole thing is like, you basically use a bunch of hair just to put it in. Um, I have to say it's an interesting thing to make, it's very cute, it's very fluffy, but I would not suggest parents to give this to your children if they're like, um, under age of 13 or 14. Um, and also on the instruction, it does says if this would primarily um, take one hour to make it. It took me quite a while to make this, to be honest. And yeah, this is really cute. I have put on the... Uh, this is really cute. I put on the little glasses. If you if you can see from the camera, um, there's still like hair flying around me. And I still got like hair, this kind of hair, like the hair in there, especially on my hoodie. Um, I do not suggest this to little kids. They are really, really small because it, it is a very big choking hazard. The kids could be like choked. Um, but if you're interested to make this on your own, if you're an adult and you want to make this for cute little things, just relax once in a while, I do recommend this. Um, yeah, and that's the review video for today. I hope you like it and see you later. Bye!